What's up, dude? What's up? <laughs> Everyone's still sleeping. Oh, okay. I'll be real quiet. We're gonna have to wake the fuck up. <laughs> What is up, people of the internet? Today, we are recording. We are recording with another beautiful bald man. We are doing acoustic tracks. We've got snuff acoustic, pretty much all the way tracked. Harmony is done, that sort of thing. Now we're gonna start on one more light, and I figured I would show, there was a couple people interested and asked me about what I was doing setup-wise for recording my music and these, like I always say, you don't need a whole bunch of expensive stuff. I have cheap guitars, cheap as in terms of musical equipment. So I tracked everything with a, a Fender acoustic guitar. Uh, I also have a PreSonus audio box, which is just a two channel interface. I have this, which is a Pod HD 500X. So I pretty much ran my guitar into that. There's an acoustic simulator or acoustic direct input response. So it basically just takes the sound of my acoustic guitar and doesn't color it or change it that much. I can boost some frequencies and do a little bit of stuff in the pedal before it goes into the DAW, it's called, which is a digital audio workstation, which is what this is, which I use Studio One for that. So to track vocals, this is the guitar right here. Fender. Definitely a decent guitar, but I picked it up for $190 at a local music store. It's definitely not a super high end, but like I always say, you, if you know what you're doing, you can record things well, you have a good player, you have a good vocalist. That's what matters most in this sort of thing. We're running vocals in the corner, basically. This is not like super, it's not super, super ideal for vocal recording, but this is what we have, so this is what we're gonna do. Put it in the corner, halfway cheap microphone. PreSonus M7, it's called. I got this, and then the audio box here, and then these speakers, all in like a bundle deal, and it was I got a really good deal on it, so I got that. This is basically how we're tracking vocals. We're going from that microphone straight into the straight into the audio box, and that's recording that's recording the vocals, and that's that's our whole signal chain. So everything that you'll hear on the vocals, everything you'll hear other than like the actual raw vocal is just done in post-production. But everything, they're acoustic tracks, so it's not like we're going heavy on the effects or anything like that. Jesse is a very, very good singer. Oh, shucks. <laughs> he does a very good, like, we pretty much ran through the whole entire song, got a bass take, and took took the good parts from that. If you've never recorded vocals and if you're into that, there's a thing called a vocal comp where you pretty much take the, the good parts of the vocal and move them to a single take, and then you will you can go through and do it like line by line or however you wanna break it down, however is more, most comfortable for the singer and the engineer, whoever's recording it. So basically we ran through the whole entire song, a good take for him to warm up, get in the groove. He was already warmed up by the time he got here because he had like over an hour drive to get to my house. So he's warming up on the way, which is always a good idea if you wanna speed up things. And I know I'm, Wasting time right here, but <laughs> we pretty much have snuff all the way done, all the vocal. I'll show you a little bit of the screen, but you can see this is the, the comp right there. And then underneath, these are the harmonies that we added in. And you can see that goes all the way across. And then there's certain spots where this is the main vocal line then you have the harmony underneath, and there's a couple spots where we did multiple harmonies for different registers because Jesse's talented enough to be able to pull that stuff off. And as a disclaimer, there's no, no pitch correction, no auto-tune, none of that going on. Everything he nailed, everything that you'll hear is done by him. None of that. Not up in here! We have snuff pretty much done. We're gonna hit one more light. I'll probably record a little bit, like him actually getting some vocals. And then the full video will be up, and I'll link it in the description and everything after it's up. But we'll be shooting an actual video, like almost like a music video type thing, for the two songs. I just wanna show you guys some behind the scenes, some stuff like this. 
some of you guys were interested and asked me about how we were going to go about doing this. So everything is recorded in this room, the same room that I film all my videos in and edit everything in. I still press your letters to my lips. So save your breath, I will not care. You couldn't hate enough to love. I have a high-pitched voice, I'm sorry. <laughs> but it just kind of goes in you the ear the, You want to do the high, high harmonies on this? The real high ones? <gasps> no. And I'm not that high pitched unless you irritate me, which is all the time. So you get my super yeah. high pitched voice. That one video, you got real angry yeah. when he scared Wait. you in the In my opinion, I always like harmonies is my downfall. Thankfully, Jesse's pretty good at it. Yeah. Normally. Actual in action recording. Who cares if one more light goes out in the sky of a million stars? <laughs> that sounds really good. <laughs> Except I messed up the words. See, that makes me want to just like almost drop the guitars almost all the way, like just mm -hmm. barely where you can even hear it. Yeah. And, and just, just have that like vocals. care, like. Yeah. I'd need a much better take of that. Yeah. I need a drink. Yes. So we just wrapped up filming. That's a lie. We just wrapped up tracking the vocals. <laughs> yes. Vocals, harmonies, all that stuff. How do you think it went? I think it went great. I am completely and utterly exhausted but i'm very very happy with where we're at at this point in time and it's not even done so and now you have to sing for camera oh i can do that i can get i can get down with that i do it in the mirror every day in the bathroom so it's fine everything 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 just everything this is what everything looks like all of the things this is what recording looks like all these are different takes, all that stuff. Man, we are talented. Everything sounds really, really good. Even better than I actually thought it would. Like, we experimented a little bit, we changed some things. He had a lot of good ideas, a lot of harmony ideas. There's a lot of stuff that wasn't in the original music that we kind of changed up a little bit, added harmonies, added little sections, dipped the music out. These songs are good. Snuff and One More Light, very good songs, very good lyrics, very good melodies, very good instruments. So we took that, tried to make it our own. I did the instruments, all the vocals, all the vocals. Very, very good job. And now we're gonna listen through these. We haven't actually listened all the way through yet. We're gonna listen to them, make sure nothing's actually wrong or we missed something. Always do that if you're into recording. Always double check everything. Another thing to keep in mind is saving it. Like every five, 10 seconds, I, w I just control S. Control save, save your work. Especially right now, because there's... If you can't hear that, there's thunder and lightning out right now. So we're trying to wrap this up as soon as we can. Next song. Next song. They're so like, I'm getting like real close up shots of yeah. your eyes and stuff, and it's in slow mo. So whenever you blink your eyes, it'll be like, oh, that's cool. cool. What score are you thinking? It's kind of weird, I know, me going like this to you. Uh, that, I'm trying to make sure that I'm not focusing on it, so I think I've done okay. I might have you look at the camera and do yeah. a couple times too. We got all Jesse's stuff tracked vocally. All harmonies, bunch of harmonies, really cool stuff. It came out even better than we anticipated. We were just talking about that. Like we got like halfway through and we we're like, oh, 
like we we're actually we're actually Ooh. doing this and it sounds real good everything's done filmed him we did it here in in this room so all there's pretty much close tight shots real detail shots i still got to do all my parts all my filming the guitar stuff all that but he worked from about nine o'clock this morning until right now it's 5 42 p.m so whole day spent on this just tracking the vocals, getting everything good, filming everything. So, and no, I'm not saying that for any other reason than to just let you guys know how much time and effort we actually put into this stuff. And I really, really hope, and I think you will see that in the, in the end product, so. That's also not including the time that you took to already have the guitar and, and drum tracks recorded yeah. and done with. So like yeah. that's extra time on top of the the full shift we put in today so. yeah that's that's just the vocal tracks all that the vocal production filming filming b busted out the gimbal right here which i use a ziyun crane 2 it's called get real stable shots and like it, it's a three axis gimbal it's called so it looks like the camera's just kind of floating around, which is really, really cool, really cinematic looking. I'm really surprised at how well this room actually looked for the video. Like, I wasn't expecting it to look that good. We were trying to figure out different ways that we could film everything, and I think we had one, one of the umbrella lights on, and then some little, kind of, they're called fairy lights in the background. I have two different colored ones and I had them sitting around back here as the backdrop, which you'll probably see in the video. I'll probably overlay some clips of me talking right here, what that actually looks like in the actual video itself. But we're going to wrap up here. I didn't film as much as I was going to behind the scenes and stuff, but I think we got enough to... We just got going. Yeah, we, we, yeah, were, we, we, were, we were working. <laughs> we had a thunderstorm in the middle of everything. We both had headphones on tracking the vocals, so... Kind of didn't want to get lightning struck and zap us all to death. We did not get zapped. Result. I'll ask you, what's, up? what's your what's your thoughts on the day and how the songs sound? Like you said, I I was I was coming into this having worked with you before and, and done this type of stuff with you before, expecting a good quality product um, as far as the recording and the video goes. But now after everything that we've done today, I'm expecting so much more than just a good quality. Uh, I think it's going to be phenomenal, and I'm really, really excited to see the finished project. Like, it's it's just pieces at this point in time, and to see what you end up doing with it. I'm super excited! I think it's going to be amazing, and uh, I think everybody's going to love it. Hopefully they do. If not, then sh shut up. Your, your face. Alright, so we're going to download some footage. I actually edit videos for Jesse's channel. He has a channel called Below Average Hiker. He does hiking videos and stuff, and I will be doing some collaborations as well on his channel, and some of his stuff will be on my channel. We'll go out adventure, adventuring and exploring a bunch of cool sites and stuff like that, so that'll be coming soon as well on top of all this music and stuff like that. So if you're interested and you like another bald dude, go check out his channel. I will be appearing on there. You'll see another bald ugly mug and uh we'll have some good times we're gonna have some good times together out the woods alone all right so we're gonna wrap up here he's got videos coming out there's new videos that'll be out i got these videos coming out the vlog here the new music to work on all the stuff coming together it's really really exciting and i'm glad to actually be producing music again it's been a while since i've actually been releasing stuff and it's been a while since i worked with jesse five or six years since we actually recorded yeah. those other songs that you guys have probably heard in the live streams and stuff. It's been about six years since we actually did that, which is way, way too long.